free for all. I just got a kill on, on slums. Fuck it, let's do this. I'm playing slums, let's go. All right, I'm not even gonna lie, I'm having fun playing slums. I'm having a good time playing on slums. Like what? What if God forbid I actually hit a trick shot on slums? I feel like if I hit a trick shot on slums, the world is just gonna like explode or something. Just like something is wrong with the universe when when somebody hits a trick shot on slums. Every, everything just spontaneously combusts. All right, guys, here comes the wall bang builder over the wall, bam. Ooh, that actually would have been cool. I mean, just imagine if I would have hit like a trick shot on slums. I feel like this is gonna become my new goal as a trick shotter. To hit an absolute bill on slums. That would be that would be awesome, actually. But so what's going on, guys? Faze Blaze can hear and I hope you guys are all having a good day so far. So yesterday I was not at home. I actually wasn't even in California, which is where I live, by the way, for those of you who don't know that. I flew up to Seattle, Washington yesterday. I was only there for a day. I left in the morning and then I came back at night. I went up there to go visit some schools. Specifically, I went to go visit the University of Washington in Tacoma. As you guys may know, I am a senior in high school and I am, you know, looking at colleges and universities, although next year I'm probably most likely going to be taking a gap year from school to work on YouTube. Now, I don't really want to talk about that too much today because it's not something that's like 100% yet and also I have a really cool story or kind of a funny story that I want to tell you guys. But so there is a pretty big chance that I might take a gap year from education to work on YouTube because YouTube's kind of a thing that's only happening, you know, right now. I'm, I'm like, right now, this is happening right now and I kind of want to see where it goes. And also for those of you who are concerned, all of the schools that I got accepted to this year, I can still attend in a year after I take my gap year. They're not going to like those offers aren't gonna go away. You really think I'm gonna be playing Nuketown anytime soon? Yeah, I'm not fucking touching that map for at least a month. I mean, most of you guys saw yesterday's 1v1 against Miss Atmosphere, and it was, it was bad. But hey, you guys really seem to enjoy me getting absolutely wrecked by her, because the ratings on that video were absolutely crazy. You guys love that video. I really like that video, too, because I put a lot more time into editing that video than usual, and it just turned out a really, really good, really funny video, I thought. But so anyway, as promised, I have a little story for you guys today. I mean, you guys absolutely love the last story I told on my channel. That was the one where I got roasted by a cop. If you guys saw that one, I know you guys love it when I tell you guys some some lazy kind of life stories. Do you, you just stunned yourself? You just tried knifing me and tomahawking me. You just stunned yourself. You're an idiot. Oh god, there are like four people here. Oh god, fuck off. A oh, headshot. Get the fuck out of my house. This is my house. This is my house. Get out. It's my house. I don't understand why you're in my house. This is my house. Why is it logging in my house? Not really sure why two. Of, wow, I just got a claw headshot. Where the fuck is everybody else? What? Collad headshot and there was nobody fucking else. Get out of my house. Wow, I was I was one off of ESAT and I died. Well, goddamn, that was that was pretty fucking eventful. I don't even remember what I was talking about. All right, so first of all, you guys are probably thinking to yourselves, Blaziken, why the fuck is the title Babies Love Blaziken? I will give you guys that. It's definitely one of the weirdest video titles I've ever had. Looks like some weird National Man Baby Love Association shit. So for this story to make sense, you guys need to know something about me. For some weird random reason that nobody can explain, babies love me. Let me give you guys an example, okay? When my cousins were babies, they would cry a lot, and my my like cousins' parents, so my aunts, they would always give me the baby because whenever I held or like hold babies they just stop fucking crying I don't know what it is maybe I smell nice or maybe my face that looks nice I don't know babies they just they love me okay they like me they, they just love me okay basically what happened yesterday is I was I was on a plane back from Washington to California as, as you guys know as I explained and I was on that plane and I was sitting in an aisle seat so I was you know on the aisle and on the other side of the aisle there was a mother with her baby by the way that baby was a cute ass baby it was a very very cute baby all babies are cute but like that was a very cute baby anyway I started looking at the baby and I I started making kind of funny faces, you know, I was entertaining the child. As I said, babies love me. And so, you know, I was kind of just making funny faces at the baby and, you know, kind of just like, you know, entertaining the baby for like five, ten minutes, I don't know. This was before my flight left, we were still on the ground, okay? And so then I stopped making faces because I kind of just, you know, wanted to get some sleep. It was a two-hour flight, I just wanted to sleep through it. And as soon as I stopped making those faces, the baby just started fucking crying. And so I'm sitting here in this aisle seat with my headphones on and I'm just trying to ignore the screaming, crying baby to get some shut eye. And then I open my eyes again and I look at the baby and, and it just stops crying. I, I don't know why. I Like I said, I have no idea. It's a fucking gift. It's a gift. But it's also a curse because I had to spend the whole plane ride, literally the entire plane ride, just like looking at that baby. Or else it would just start crying on the plane and I just, just so I literally just sat there listening to music and playing games on my app and I was just looking at the baby for the whole flight. A two-hour flight just spent looking right at a baby. Orbital V set. I got the Orbital V set. But so yeah, I guess that was my weird slash funny experience of the day. Watch, it's gonna be super ironic. One day I'm gonna have like a, a son or a kid or a baby or whatever, and it's just gonna fucking hate me. Every time I hold my own baby, it'll just start crying, but every time I hold somebody else's baby, it'll just stop. But yeah, not really gonna be getting any girls pregnant anytime soon, cause, well. Well, anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video, and if you guys did, make sure you guys smash that like button. I hope you guys enjoy the rest of your days. You know, relax, take it easy, have, have a great rest of your day. And also remember to stay sloppy, by the way. But yeah, that's been it. Peace.